Right then, it allows me. If it will allow me. No? Yes. Right then, here we go then. Apologies for the delay, but. We're now here, another guys are welcome to Tier 1 Pacific Season 3, Round 4 here in Baku. And uh, joining me in the conference box, as always, is Dr. Wong. Thank you, Leopard. Good to be back again. As you can already tell, qualifying is well and truly underway. We've got Timmy setting the fastest time at the current moment with a 37.9. Already had uh, three people retire already in the form of both the uh, Tyra Rosso boys and Exodona in the McLaren. We missed, we missed something there, but uh, we'll pass over that. Uh, so yeah, Timmy on pole position for now. Day uh, seven mark. Which is effectively the quick guys before we get to the low day sevens, maybe even the high thirty. Never, no. But 
Ray is back after his ramble uh, appearance in Australia. In the Red Bull this time. Here in Baku. But, um, yeah, none of the usual suspects currently in the, at the front, it seems. It's still early stages at the moment. I mean, from New Zealand Ryan that you can see currently last on the table at the moment, but there's still a long way to go. 12 minutes left here in the quality session. Yeah, uh, what we have is uh, ECR Ricardo is uh, without a drop win. Oh, there he is. Master, I believe, is just starting his or another flying lap. Let's see what he can do. Not oh, zombie! Great master, last time out. I'd like to guess Castle or S section. That would be, I guess, quite a stun map. Not the F's. Yeah. I'm sure I'm glad the castle. Great Master 6 is up. And the Ultra Sire. Now, I'm guessing we're gonna see... Moreno here. No? Okay, maybe it's been cleared. Who knows? Last unfortunate zombie. Yes. And, uh, he'll, he'll have to rest on that 39.60 star. I hope that's a fairly decent fourth hand position. I mean, flying outside the top 10 isn't necessarily a bad thing, it's not ideal, but you, know, you, get, you get fresh tyres in the race, which is a bonus, but you'd obviously like to be in that top 10 higher up, higher up the grid what Greenmaster is going to try and do in this flying lap. Hoping the DRS is going to be the Williams. It's actually going to divert into the pit, so... Just call that. I think he's already done a couple of laps on this ultra soft tyre, so he's probably maybe burned up a little bit of rubber. Possibly. Maybe wanting to avoid saying a lap time on that set. Defense. On an outlap right now, super soft tires now. Pencil Man just went to P5. Oh yeah, 39 more. Oh, Michi. Michi. What's happened to Michi? Anything. Trying to find him on the track. Struggling to at the moment. No, I haven't found him yet. Thank you as always, Code Masters, for uh, ruining our uh, chance to find out where the heck he's crashed. Oh, that's power. Ryan. Ryan 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 Usually happens with the Zealand ride for me in a quality session, it usually fixes itself for, for the race. Yeah. Yellows. Oh, just big cars slowing down, I think. Yeah, possibly. Quite a variety here of uh, what tyres these guys are on. There's a few guys on super soft yeah. tyres. Ryan. 38.3 for New Zealand Ryan. Oh yeah. Super softs. So he jumps up to P3 just ahead of his, uh, just ahead of his team of gold power actually. 
Brickmaster is on the soft tyres. This is interesting. Why the soft tyres? I wonder. As Timmy's now so out of quality. Two. Why well, the softs? Well, not the supers. Don't know. We ever know. Maybe it's some interesting strategy play by Greek Master. Of course, he needs to make up a few points in the championships in New Zealand Rhine, so... What happened to Timmy? The ball, uh, professional ball center. What's happened? I have no idea. I couldn't find him on my screen. Out of, uh... <laughs> Under which fans cut. Uh, yeah. Oh, what a great mask to see if, where Timmy's bend it. Can't seem to find Timmy or anyone at the moment who's bend it, so. Um, Probably lost off. off. Wait. So far, six guys already out of qualifying. That is quite a substantial, substantial number. Drivers already have quality, including the two Toro Rossos, Big Berserk and modern Brendan Hartley. Yes. He is now chosen to be known as for today. Chim shut up to the line, what can he do? No, can't do anything, into the pits he goes. Benz has just tiny gone spotter. straight on, I think, at Fet, turn Fet. two. Uh, yeah, probably would have been turned to. He's now the ultra soft suspense, but Greek Master on the softs. So the 38A, which is put it up for right now. Right behind his championship rival. Yep, that'll be a tasty ball once again. Greek Master. Uh, yeah, not the greatest round for him in uh, China, in a wet China, uh, and Excel in those conditions. Rick Master, not so much. I mean, he got a decent P5, 10 points on the board, but at the end of the day, he has lost 15 points to his main championship rival, New Zealand Ryan. I'll be looking to make at least some of that margin up today in Baku. And there won't be ever any weather to deal with because I've been told by Michi it's going to be a dry race as well. Well, hopefully it's something to look forward to. I mean, some wet weather around back it would have been very interesting. Uh, like all dry. Which hopefully you'd think would mean uh, a few more versions around this street circuit. Yeah. 
DRS round about now at the run up to the line. What's it gonna be for fans? It'll be pole position for the fans at 37 8. Puts Very in nice slap. Position. Yeah, very good lap indeed. As I said earlier, I was expecting at least low days, but it seems like with these every drive on the harder tyre, it doesn't seem to be occurring, so defense, I mean, might just have that pole position done and dusted, unless, hang on, you've been the as a truck number seven, or two more tyres, and you're bringing out the truck number seven to see if it's top tyres. Jim Shah will be looking to improve. Dominator move to P8. On the six on tyres, P8, 39.3. Might want to go for that again. He's got enough battery, I reckon, to go for that again. If he wants, so. Right, with wide, him, though, get away the with the traffic. in the run still lagging for me can we watch the championship leader i think we can through the castle section fourth gear down to third championship leader on the ultra soft tire so he'll be looking for that for the fourth and fourth position chooses to mount the curb unlike dominator there's green master green master's on the run up and through the line I want to avoid the left to use. Ooh, P3. Third with a 37 8. That's, that could have so easily been pole position. They used a whole lot more deployment. But New Zealand ride then. The world to the line. Oh, the death row. Top third, 37 8. So Mercedes. Top three, but I think New Zealand ride. Here we go. Yeah, there he is. Speed. He smashes the pole time. Great master. He could have been a bit on the front row. He needs use a whole lot more deployment. He has so much deployment left to use. Almost a quarter of it, probably more. So if he used, used it, he could have been on the front row. Maybe not quite uh, on pole position, but definitely up there. But it is what it is. New Zealand Ryan claims position half a second quicker than defends chim child does a pretty decent job in the house 378 on death row also 378 on the super sauce actually yes so he's being great mass on the super sauce what a lot there uh on death row dominator is down in ninth uh timmy in sixth goal pass seven that back person eighth tiny score 10th that rounds out the top 10 we've, we've got pencil man 
Berserk, Warden, all outside the top 10. And they'll be hoping for a miraculous recovery in this Azerbaijan Grand Prix. They are going to need it so, big time. Greek the Toro Rosso is uh, way yep. down. 18th and 19th. Yeah, not a good qualifying for the Toro Rossos. Um, and before I've forgotten something, but I'm pretty sure that is an error from the Toro Rosso. So yeah, they'll be looking for a recovery. But New Zealand Ryan on pole position, albeit on the ultra soft tyres. Do you think we could see Death Row and Greek Master maybe challenge uh, towards the end of a stint, maybe? It's uh, tough to say, really. We, I mean, not sure what the tyre wear is like. I assume maybe the ultra softs are just going to burn off very quickly compared to the super soft tyres. But going to be very interesting to see how it goes. Yeah, indeed. I mean, I've done, I think, one race around Baku. And uh, you're looking to pit from the Ultrasofts to the Softs around, around lap six. Super soft tyres, I think uh, Warden's on the soft tyres. So it's charging for Toro Rosso's. Berserk looking to be the quicker of them to the start of the race, and then Warden will quick out the end. We'll see how that uh, plays out. Uh, I'm in the wall of the castle section, so you might want to do that. Back up towards the front, New Zealand Ryan on pole position, looking to make it three wins from four. And take a quite substantial lead over Greek Master, who we think could be the man to challenge New Zealand Ryan this season in all of the Pacific. He's said to be the man to mount that challenge, but New Zealand Ryan. Right now, it's definitely got one up on Greek Master 99. And of course, Ryan won the corresponding race, I think, last season in TOR Pacific as well. Yeah. Yeah, indeed. As they all line up to the grid as we wait for Externa in last position. To roll up. Here we go then. We are about to get underway here in Baku. Here we go then. Lights out of the way to go. I guess a much better start than Ben. So far to be uncharged into third one. We have the Hass of Chinchar into second place. Death Row has kept his third position. Free Master. With Machine, he's under attack from Timmy. He's going to try and hold it around the outside. Oh, it's chaos. Oh, it's a pile up further back. Pile up further back. Huge pile up. Oh, Both dear. Ferraris. Yeah, both Ferraris, in fact. Round. We've got external with damage. I think Master with Circle have damage. Definitely both Ferraris. Station in first position. 
Safety car. He's come in. It's that mask on. Driver is kick sharp in. So Greek master is going to take the effective lead baby of the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. He's in the right turn. Chuck on and set off. Take the soft tires, it is soft, you'll go to the end of the safety car period in the river. Actually, so it's a fourth position. So everyone's had to pit due to the chaos. Gold Power's got to do front wing. Simi's got to do front wing. Both Toro Rosso's will have a new front wing. Fence just pits normally. Dominate the... No, I think it'll stay out. What a manic start that was. That's <laughs> my shot on three. Chaos unfolding. And the uh, two's had to fit out of all that. I think majority of the guys that are on the ultra soft tyres have come in and got off them very quickly and put on the soft tyres, I think, the majority of them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, only three not Big master on me. And Pencil Man are the three drivers yet to pit. Everyone else has made a pit stop, either reacting to the safety car or due to sheer wing damage. I think Gold Power. I think Gold has to change his wing. Maybe Fens. I'm pretty sure everyone from Timmy down has had to change their wing something during this race. But the safety car is. has definitely helped them out to get back in this race. But four DNFs already. Ray, I'm Death Row, Mitchie, and Tiny Scotto, all that one of the Adelaide Grand Prix. And, um, they'll have to wait till next week to redeem themselves. Yeah, Greek Master leading this race. Now, on those six off tyres. Zombie and Pesson are behind on the soft. In the ride, fourth place. I thought it was going to be much further, but it's not because everyone else in the line has to hit, so yeah. in the ride still. In uh, the effect of 
like a white large brick mass is definitely have to get a move on uh, if he's going to have any chance of uh, winning this race otherwise he's in the right unless Ryan gets caught up in uh, some sort of incident on the restart he definitely will be back to that mm, indeed this is definitely he's in the right to lose Chelsea in the carbon fiber on next turn two this track can cause a lot of chaos don't get me wrong yeah, I think we learned that. I think we uh, had the chaos. Um, truth be told, it was chaos. Indeed. Yeah, the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Yeah, everything's going to settle down. But now, I'm kind of worried about the chaos I'm sure to fall on the same car we start. There's going to be a few dive bombs, I reckon. Oh, yeah. Turn one, turn two, turn three. We'll definitely see a few dive bombs there, and maybe turn one the next lap as well. Yeah, hopefully if these guys keep it clean, it should sell down. Although that might ruin our entertainment, so I don't know what. But, <laughs> uh, but yeah, for the driver's sake, let's like, hope these guys can keep it clean, and uh, hopefully some wait for track battling racing whatever you want to call it um, let's hope that can unfold and set up just your chaos and run wings everywhere yeah so there's only four guys on the super soft tyres that being Greek who started on the super soft got laggy as well uh, Warden is, is also on Super Sauce and ECR Ricardo. Everybody else is on soft tyres. Safety car coming in this lap. Yeah. Uh, before this gets under all, oh, going for the zombie. Hey, Greek Master, that's not going to help him. Um, but yeah, Warden has got Super Sauce to start on the soft tyres, so he's not got any soft tyres remaining. That's why he has got Super, so he'll try okay. and get those to the end, but um, probably have to make on the pit stop, but Greek Master now leading this field. He controls the pace, he'll choose to get this race back on the way. Any moment now. Take in things oh, nice yeah. and slowly. Oh, there's chaos. Oh, uh, here we go then. There's more, there's more penalties. Greek Master, great start for Greek Master. He gets it underway. Oh my right. god, this is could turn chaotic. Three wide. And they kept it clean into turn one. I think they can. Will they keep it clean into turn two though? A bit of side by side action. No, there's chaos. No, there is. Yeah, he came straight in master. after that safety car restart. Yeah, the ring master's going on this. Uh, safety car restart to perfection. He's got a 2.7 second lead, and he's got his teammate Pencil Man in second place. So, he, the wing man, potentially. You know, we'll see if he plays to be a wing man. You could call him that. But he can definitely try and hold up the Zealand Ryan. That could definitely play. Has Ben's got wing damage, maybe. No, I see service from wing attacked, I think. Oh, and I think it's that Matt is one that does have a strong attack. Oh, yeah, he's got damage yeah, on his back front Midfield slash front, I think more than has escaped for that. He wing out, so that's good. Let's see one champion. They fly through. Yes, it's Timmy going to be going to side by side with Penske. Run up to two, third one. Oh, Ryan. Uh, Ryan in. He's in the right in the pit. Wow. Change. Yes, it is. It is for a wing change. Zilla 
inside and some, some kind of window during all of that. And that has won the championship completely in Greek Master's favour. Greek Master, a clean air, looking to clear off. He's got a second lead to his teammate Pencilman. This championship has been turned right on his head. Wowee, I was not expecting that. Nor was I, and I think anyone would expect that. You see the bride, it's down at 40, and he might have to make even another stop. Thomas seems soft tires. Like oh, Master He's Berserk. Tires. He's had it off in turn two. Uh, Tommy Clay right out of his head. Master Berserk has got any wing damage. Hopefully not, that'll be kind of embarrassing to bring to the fence for a new wing, and then down here again. Immediately. Yeah. The Green Master, he is in control of this front and all seems to be down this championship. I said he'll be looking to gain uh, some points on using the riding quality. I don't think Mike can expect this potentially the full 15 and more. But he is definitely in control of Pedro Man, as you say. He's in soft tyres, actually gaining time on his teammate, Green Master. Water through four, fastest lap of the race. Pencil match boy 3 3 takes the fastest lap of the race. Away. Domination of Benzo now going to start by side. Into turn one of the Benzo breaks. But uh, later, runs massively wider than X Dona there. More Warden up the inside of Timmy. Just got a hit. Still going to come back. Yeah. No. Things better off. Oh, we got. Uh, oh, that was close. Four bar move. Four bar move. Oh. Uh, he's going to go for it again. Yeah. Dominate is going. Oh, it's good. Not three wide, are they? Right. No, I don't think they are. Wise move. Dominate is now in position to Exodona in all the battling. Oh, he's crashed! They run through the castle section. <laughs> oh, he's got Ricardo. Uh, this is such a good point to make the decision, and he's now going to have to come in for a new front wing. Don't be the head. Yeah, that's all you need to hear. Dominate has got the back pass the next time. Let's get past the penalty. Can Ferrari drive to do that? Oh, uh, Exodona's out. Oh, Exodona's retired. Got Warden, got Gold Power, and Laggy on uh, Pencil Man. Oh, it's chaos. Chip Char. Damage. Safety uh, car again. Oh, safety <laughs> car. Safety car again, so he does have damage. And now it's pretty easy to drive back into this. Yes, it does. This race is not disappointing so far. How many have we lost now? I think that's six we've lost throughout this race. That stays out. Yeah, we've lost Chipchar, next owner, Ray, Death Road, Minchie, Scott. So, yeah, six drivers we've lost from this Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Master Berserk's put the soft tyres on. Yeah, I think he's got a drive through for speeding in the pit lane. Yeah, yeah, that was so a you have to come back in. See the pit lane flood with uh, the cars once again. It's be interesting to see who does pit. Yeah, I feel like Pencil Man might stay out. Those two stops are to stay out. Right, the Green Master 
Well, yeah, great save. Into the pits. Race leader into the pit lane. That lag person into the pits. Petzelman into the pits as well. Yeah, it's double stack at Williams. Order. Into the pits. So, Joel Power is going to be now the leader of this race. Penske will be in second. And everyone seems to be in the pits, interestingly enough. Yeah. Ben's in. For another set of softs. Brian, obviously, come into the pits. That is five wide for now the driver and championship leader. This is and just what he Ricardo. needs. Yes. Indeed. So back on to the softs for New Zealand Ryan. He'll now attempt to go to the end. Yeah, now Gold Power is leading this Grand Prix. And if I'm not mistaken, is, yeah, he's got the effective lead as Gold Power, so your running order is somehow for now in this Grand Prix. Now everyone can go to the end, I believe. Uh, if there are no safety cars. So Gold Power leads this race from Penske, from Green Master. He wants to get past those two, you'd think, fairly quickly. That laggy yep. person, he's like an amazing race in Renault. Zombie Hunt, uh, might have to pit again. Pencil Man also might have to pit again. Potentially, might try and get those to the end, not quite sure. Warden, in 7th place, dominated in 8th, Benson like that. Should be an interesting battle for those three to get through the field and maybe try and snatch a position off one another. Timmy is in P10, Ikea Ricardo. Now back in this race, he's in P11, he's in the Ryan Championship leader, out of the points, P12. And it's that matter, Master Berserk will follow. Back up to the train. Is that man has actually decided to come into the pits? Soft tyres, perhaps? Yeah, to sink. Yeah, soft tyres it is. But, um, yeah, Master Berserk now will be on the back of the train, but he's going to be right back off it and immediately after he has to take his drive through and see. Yes. Yeah. What an opportunity this is, though, for goal power. Big opportunity to I lead mean, the field. Yeah, this is, I mean, I think he was having, the have been another race last season where he fly up, ended up uh, further up the field uh, than he expected at some point during the race. Yeah, it's a big opportunity for Gold Power. I think it's fair to say, not the sound that we were expecting to be leading this, this race at this moment in time. A little switcheroo there. Yep. Today is maybe Gold Power from Kickstarter season of our championship challenge, you never know. Um, yeah. Let's see if this, this race might get in the way at the end of the slap, potentially. We'll find out. Very right. shortly. definitely want to get past these two and just get on with this race. Hope for no more safety cars. Live on the theory. Well, keep out the barriers and then theory quit. And avoid getting damage from and other yep, cars. Safety car. Yeah, safety car in, in this lap. Here we go. For the second time. As 
not mucking around here. No, I, I, th I think he's being limited. The pace he's doing right now. So it's an interesting restart. Goal power. Has to go now. Yeah, here we go. That's massively changed the things. He goes defensive on great master. Okay, that's all tidy, I think. Oh, oh no, it's not laggy. Yet. Yeah, just a bit. keeps the lead for now. Yeah, what a strange restart that was. That's a weird one. Gold power just wanted to get straight away. Yeah, he wants to get going and they slowed it right back down again. Yeah. He's really getting the momentum. Right, so many cars right there. What's going on? It's got Greek. Oh, that was very close to the wall there for Greek. Oh, it's a nice contact! Zombie's gone! Oh, it's chaos. Yes. Ricardo's out. Both the Toro Rossos are back in the pits. Doesn't quite have any wing damage. It's his way to lose the lead. Golba, Pesselbach. Is it the dominator anymore? What a missed opportunity that is for Greg Master. Oh, fans has made an error. Turn three. Helpful. Darcy's going to run up any wing damage. Not really. So I think he's escaped wing damage. But five days of trace. <laughs> so many ups and downs. Got bad caps on slightly. But Kensky is leading this race. It's only lap 12 right now. We're not even halfway through the race yet. I know. Crazy, crazy. Minus, uh, it's P6. I'm like a person. Not too sure. Anyway, Petsky is in the effective lead. Oh, he has the fun. Great. Followed by Golf Hour in second. Oh, Fens has made an error. He's lost his front wing. Behind we've got pencil bad. Look into the inside of goal power. This is the second place in this race. But it's gonna go down the inside. Oh, oh Fens is out. Fens is out of the race. Busy watching this battle though. Two. Pencil bad's got moved on with goal power. And he's in the right position. More position. He's down to beat seven. What's happening? Yes, I was watching it on board. Keep out of the walls or don't retire. You've got a point. Yes, er everyone in the top ten is getting points. Yep. What a race is turning out to be. New Zealand Brides somehow losing four positions. Um, I said yeah. Bahrain might be the, the best race I've seen so far in the commentary box. I think Baku may have just topped that now. 
Yeah, I mean, it's, it's two very different races. Back is provided absolute carnage, which is no problem. not too great on track action, I guess, in terms of, maybe not on track action, but, you know, side by side, close racing, but it's definitely provided carnage as well. And Mara definitely provided side by side action that we so love in racing at most points. go. Okay. Off for the race late. Trying to stay out of chaos, I reckon. Possibly. That might be spotted if he is. Pencil bunch back down! Oh no! What a shame for William. Had we tried to crack, I wonder. I think the guy possibly in the best position right now is pro probably Dominator in the Ferrari. Yeah, indeed. Right, I've got that slash back in. Or it's back in. Anyway, we're going to the race. Penske still leads this Azerbaijan top three. As I said, Dominator in a fairly decent position in P2. Oh, I've got that like person. Maybe try and go down the inside. That's a risky uh, move. Power. And Ryan is now back. Come back from this train. Love the DRS set for sure. Now dominator now. Can he make the move? Get the run here. Oh, it's It may be soon. Back down the inside. Oh, that's Ball's more contact. I think that could be laggy. I'm not sure that they have lost a bit of carbon fibre. Here comes Ryan. Oh, it's contact. Contact, I think that lucky person gets away with potentially further wing damage with gold power. I think it was gold power that's ended up with wing damage. I'm not too sure, but dominated out with that bit of the lead. He's uh, trying to stretch this lead out. And attempts. Away and play the Spurs with on the season. Who would have thought he was at the back of the grid at, oh, at the end of lap one? That would have been a bit awkward. Very, very close. Yeah, Ryan should have the run now. Yep, he's got it up the inside. That lucky person on a better run. He's got better slip straight. Look he's at this. To the inside. Here we go. That lucky person. There's got the inside easier than Ryan. And it's got the bit done. Double overtake for that lucky person. Got Gold Pedal's come into the pits. Yeah, I think it was hit with the wing damage. Yeah, he'll yep. check on the same six stops, I reckon. They'll go to the end. Meanwhile, these are the right back down. He's right down the right! No!
Wow, we this is one hell of a race, I can tell you now. Yeah, he's got a good pace. Even in DRS as well. section. Here we go then, Timmy. Uh, Dominator's just got to use this in battery. He's got to use it. Timmy will look. Covering. To the outside of Dominator. Dominator's oh. much later. Timmy will get the switch back. Oh, it's contact. Timmy's on the inside. Potentially be Timmy's first TR Pacific win, I believe. I don't think he's ever had a win it in TR Pacific. His first, his first podium, even if he doesn't get past Dominator. Dominator solo on the battery. Popped up into high DRS Dominator. Overtake for Timmy. I think we're going for round two here. Timmy. Get past Dominator. He's closing on the Ferrari. Dominator yes. goes defensive. Timmy looking to the outside of the Ferrari. Has he got the move done? I think he has. Timmy takes the lead on the other by Jean Grand Prix. What scenes we are witnessing here on lap 19 of 26. Has Dominator fight back? It's got DRS. Oh, there's contact. Contact is further than the keeper clean for now. Timmy is in the lead of the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Potentially going to be on the sprint for CLR win. I thought it was Dominic's French Blue, but as soon as he's in the ride, crashed out of the race. 
still got a good 80 points to play. Will he choose to uh, back out? Way. But you got know, the two more Sidious meanwhile, close proximity of each other, and all oh, that lucky person has been to the castle. That's uh, a bit of a throw wake up, I'm guessing. Oh, White's up that like camera angle, but yeah, the two more Sidious. Close proximity. Timmy has dropped away. The gap's now eight tenths of a second. Dominator, got in hot that mode. Stop the McLaren driver. Got it over in second. Might be out of DRS. He is. He is out of DRS. It's Timmy. Oh, we got the four Cindy's. One of the greatest. Give up to two four Cindy's, as you say. Oh, now at him. Let's just concede for now. Send it back oh, up the other side. Oh, side by side. Oh, they're still side by side. Yes, that man's done a good job. Oh, careful here. Oh! I'm leaving like real life there for a second. Look at this close. They're still. Here we go, Cabro Tong. Put P3 in the final podium position. Oh, inside Penske. That they really want. Penske gets it. Does he? Yes, he does. Penske. Just. Gets the move. What a race this is turning out to be. And what a story <laughs> that could be unfolding. Timmy has got about six, seven laps to go. And he's clearing off. The gap's now one and a half seconds. Not using any of ERS for now, but he'll bump up into everything, I'm guessing, the main straight. Jack looks back in there. Low ERS mode, you can bump that up into overtake if you want, mate. Dominator in high. Timmy in medium. Now it's overtake mode. The McLaren driving in a few more. Tenths of a second here. Back down to medium. He's still got Dominator out of DRS. And Dominator trying to use some ERS to try and get back into the DRS. DRS meanwhile, in that match. Penske going back at it again. I think it's the Matt has just got that move done. Good this time. See that laggy right, person. Right up the inside. Oh, Penske down the inside. Got the RS. Oh, it's badly here. Careful. Penske. Yes, the move back on his Orsidia teammate. It's laggy into this battle as well. Yep. Indeed it has, that laggy person in the red Oh, Our master Zerk's had to come into pits for some reason. Find out, it might be just for a fresh set of tyres and massive slap. Front wing. Going in for a wing change. He'll be able to play faster slap back though if he wants. Yeah. That gap is increasing at the front. 2.9 seconds now. I know. I know. It's very close to the wall. Bumped up to overtake once again. Timmy. Increasing his lead at the front. There is back in meanwhile. Go back on one with the foul. Oh no! Matt's out. Oh no, three out! Oh look at all those three cars. Great fatality in the space of two seconds. So, this is all out. Yeah, sorry, done that. Uh, last second. Beat by fair shot, I'm all of it. Warden, 
Uh, I've got no idea. Let's have a look. Where is it? Three stops. Three stops. Master Berserk's made five stops. He's going to finish fifth at this rate. Well, yeah, at this rate. Yeah, there we go, Master Sir. Into P5. Most of these guys have moved up the grid as well. Timmy up five spots, Dominator up seven spots, Warden up 16 spots. Gold Power up three, and Master Sir up 13 spots. Yeah, I think he's losing, I think he's just wasting too much battery. He's just got to save a little bit more to probably have any shot, but I think it's, it's starting to dissipate. And, uh, Most of these guys were caught up early on in the early race carnage. Yeah, six drives remain. Once they're out of the race, that much like first head skin, here's that back. New Zealand Ryan, Nethan, Yeah, Ricardo, Coffee Hub, Ringmaster, Shipchar, Exododa, Ray, I'm Death Row, Vinci, Tiny Scotto, all out of the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. It's 13 odd people out of this race. Timmy gets through another lap for now. He's running up to Ose. He has once again. Oh, he's low on fuel though. Low on fuel. Ooh, this could play the Dominator's hands here. Possibly. Four seconds down the gap. Timmy and Dominator. Extending that gap. He's got 40 RS to get saved yet in the right places. Got Yellison Sector 2. Master Zerk in the Castle section. Yeah. He's lost uh, a bit more weight. That's a Toro Rosso. Oh, I think he's gonna start. Possibly. He did set the fastest lap as well, 139.532. Yeah, so he's got that, yeah. He's probably got like 130 on the boat. Good man. Finish the that. race down. Careful guys with that fast left right hander. Up. Yep, Berserk back in again. Yeah, Timmy, the gap's down five seconds. He's going to be starting the penultimate lap. Very, very short. I think 
for Dom. He can just afford to just bring it home in second. He's got a big gap back to yeah. Warden. Bring it home. Back a place. Goal power. And more position. Great race. The goal power is going to play home. So, very valuable. Four points. May help Salva in the Constructors Championship as well. Yeah, it might. I mean, this Constructors is going to be very close. Um, and Goldbauer is doing a good job of claiming solid four points for Salva. Yeah. Uh, New Zealand right being out of the race. That's got one lap to go as a nice shot on three. Dominator has got a bit more back now, but still not enough. Gap's way too big now. Way too big, it's too late. To all you have to do is bring it home. Just cruise, Timmy, just cruise, bring it home. Something incredible. Something I think none of us expected to see. No, I definitely did not. Into this race. He's got around half a lap to go. That's eight seconds now. The thing is, he's not one of he has dominated by well, not dominated. I'm gonna hold back. Get through the castle, mate. He's yeah. done that. Don't go too early. Don't hold give him the commentator's it. curse. No, I'm gonna wait. Um section. One more breaking zone to go. Get nice and cautiously through this fast left right hander. It's not through. Well, okay. I don't believe what I've just witnessed. I don't believe what I've witnessed. But Timmy, in the McLaren, is going to win. COR in Baku. What a race. What a win for Timmy. Well done. Dominator is going to come home in second place. Warden will somehow play home P3, that's a solid 15 points to him. Master Berserk will claim P5. Yeah, finish side by side, Goal why power. not? Claim P4. And Penselman will claim P3. What a race! And what a result! Timmy! has just won the Azerbaijan Grand Prix for McLaren. Unbelievable. He wins. Lost the words right now. I'm probably going to call this race the most Absolutely chaotic incredible. race of the season and we haven't even got to Monaco yet. I know. I think it's fair to say, well done, Baku. What a race that was. Absolutely. A Timmy <laughs> wins the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. And to top it all off, we get two, two and a half thousand XP. Lovely. Oh my goodness. Gee whiz, this has been chaotic. Timmy wins, obviously, from Dominator. Brendan Hartley, we could call him, or Warden, is in P3. Gold Power in fourth. Master Berserk, fifth. Pencil Man in sixth. And then everybody from seventh onwards is all DNFs. I know. I would not have 
I woke up to say I definitely did not expect this race to unfold. Oh my wow. goodness. What has just happened? <laughs> that was a bit boring, wasn't it? A bit boring? You say it's you. a bit boring, Warden. <laughs> <laughs> That was a something else, and the result on top of it just makes it even sweeter. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. Everybody's in, Fair I think, for the podium. If you can answer by, uh, oh, this is, uh, this the... is half of the finishing field. Good job, guys. Yeah, very, half. very true. Oh, yeah, half. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> no words. I don't blame you, Timmy. What a race. Um, Roscoe. I'm lost of words. Pick us off with this, with these podium interviews. Yeah, I don't know really, really what to say, but congratulations, Timmy. That's an absolute fantastic effort. You probably weren't even expecting to win this race. Now you have your first race win. Yeah, it's not got a mic, so... It's probably not got a mic, so... That's why that... Wow. Um, yeah. What about you, Dom? Uh, we... P2, after uh, the early, what was it, lap one chaos that you got caught up with? Yes. You probably weren't expecting to either get on the podium yourself. Oh, I was literally finished the first lap and I was like, well, race over. I was like hoping for a safety car. Then that happened and it all happened and I bottled my racing qualifying, to be honest, because for my first run in quali, I used a pair of softs, and I went five laps on them. Then in the race, when I got my first lap incident, I went into a pair of softs. So at the end, I was on when I started my final seven lap nine, I was on twenty percent worn softs. So I had to tie save for the entire race, which is annoying. But GG to me, you deserve that man. Yeah, I, that does, I guess, explain it. Uh, I was gonna ask you, what was that? I guess lack of pace all about because it looked yeah. like you would be in control of that race as soon as you got the lead. I thought, I think Roscoe thought as well, you know, job done, Dominator's got this race. But uh, I guess that explains everything. Um, but yeah. Timmy, uh, I guess capitalised on your uh, tyre wear and uh, did a very good job of it. Got the lead. Mm -hmm. You actually had a very, very good battle um, through sector one, I think it was. Yeah. And, uh, Timmy then... was also running medium TC, so very penis, but that's still a good job to him. Yeah. And yeah, Timmy mm -hmm. just robbed away afterwards. Well, we'll move on to Warden. Oh, oh Mr. Brendan um... Hardley himself. Oh, yeah. Yeah, all that. I, like I think that. That you are another one that wasn't quite expecting I was to be on the podium. <laughs> um, I don't know, my race was trash. And then all of a sudden, three people were out at the our chicane in the GGs. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, you got caught up in... Oh, yeah, I was involved in everything. Yeah. <laughs> So many instances you were Was there anything you to... weren't involved in this whole race, Warden? Uh, that last crash. That's all I needed. <laughs> yep. I don't know. Yeah, I think we pretty much covered everything. Uh, regarding the championship, um, you didn't obviously have the greatest of round one, but you've, you've had two solid results. Uh, I think it's fair to say. Now, podium. Can you maybe kick on from here? Potentially, uh, mount some sort of a championship challenge, or aim for know. a top three finish, or I don't know. What, what are you aiming for? Probably just like from now. I don't know. Aim for podiums, maybe a win. <laughs> She'll be right. At least I'm doing better than the real Brendan Hartley. <laughs> that is very true. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Uh, uh, Dominator, uh, move quickly yeah. back onto you on the regards of the championship as well. With 
the two main protagonists, Greek Master and New Zealand Ryan, both crashing out of this race. You have now gained 18 points on them. I'm not quite yes, sure. P2. No. Where that leaves you. P2 in the standings. Do you know how many points yeah. you are behind New Zealand Ryan? Because oh, I have fuck. no clue. It's not going to matter. I'm missing the next two races because of Bathurst 1000. I've got a party, so. It's ah, going to get enough. Been a bit, but at least I got that. It's going to be more like one yep. race now with that game. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough then. Um. But yeah, good job on P2. It's I guess it's a shame that you can't make the next next two races or so. Um, yes. Let's hope a miracle can happen and you do end up back in this championship fight after all that. But um, I'm just you never know. It, and stuff. Yeah, it it is Formula One at the end of the day. At the end of the day, so anything can happen. But unless you have anything else to add, Rocco, I think that's gonna that's gonna. We wrap might as well just end it now. I think we've done everything we can. <laughs> Yeah, we've, we've we've covered everything. Massive congratulations to Timmy once again on his very first TOR Pacific win. But um, until uh, next time out in Spain for round five, where I'm guessing it's going to be slightly less chaotic. Um, More than likely. Yeah, until then. Until then, bye-bye.